mine and Giorgio's two years. We had like a slow start to the morning because we have so many fun activities planned. The open gifts in bed, just cute little sentimental gifts. Now we're going for a walk before we head into this city. My fit, this is Anna Hyde's new line. She literally slayed live by. Sickening. Gorgeous day out. Gorge. George is fighting for his life right now. The thing I will never understand about George is that he is legit for a career, for your job, plays basketball, cannot walk, hates walks. I'm just not, you know, I do the walks from Lori, but you know, I could go play 40 minutes of basketball straight, but you know, to go on a walk just defeats me. Brought George to Pilates yesterday. He was struggling. I was struggling. I gave up a lot. But it's okay. You're going to go back, right? We're going to a paint and sip in the city. We've been saying forever, like, let's do paint and sip. Let's do paint and sip. And honestly, I'm like, mm. all the times we were going to go, I was like, eh, I don't feel like going. Mostly because, like, this probably is going to sound bad. I don't want the painting. Like, I want to create it, but I don't want to keep it. Doing it together will be fun and sentimental. And, like, we blocked off this day to just do fun things and we're gonna get rubies for like brunch slash lunch george has never been to rubies and i cannot wait for dinner like i'm thinking about it already because it's my favorite place ever i'm gonna go no mascara because that's my favorite thing to do no mascara during the day also just got the aura ring obsessed obsessed i can't tell if the steps are accurate i feel like it's telling me i'm getting way more steps than i actually have gotten which i don't like because i care the most about my steps but seeing the sleep score is the coolest thing ever like i really was influenced by george because he got the whoop and i was like making fun of him because i was like oh my god like enough with the sleep but then i was getting a little jealous and feeling a little left out when he would check his sleep score in the morning and I was like, well, I want to know what my sleep score was. So now I don't feel left out. And it looks like a piece of jewelry that I would wear because it's like chunky and gold. So more updates to come. It's still calibrating because I've only had it for like two days. So it's still adjusting to my body. I think it needs like a week or so to really be accurate. Okay, here's the outfits. I am feeling like very casual, but... I feel like it's cute. Like, we're literally going to go painting. So, the jewelry adds. Picasso. I hope we like these glasses. Do we like these? All right. Well, okay. It's cute. It's fun. It's fresh. I'm starving. So, we're going to go. Pretzel for the road. <laughs> Sweet. Thank you. This is my favorite at Ruby's. George, look at that. Definitely want to bite. And the fries. First bite. My favorite French fries in the world. It was fab. What do you rate it? That was George's first time ever having rubies. It's really solid. It was really good. The fries. The fries were delicious. They I were. think I'm more obsessed with the fries. Oh, so I really, I really like the the fried chicken. Actually, made great time because we didn't leave Jersey City until what, like 12:45. Later, Maybe a little like, later, like 1.15, like and it's 2.17 2 right now. The food came, no joke, four so fast after we ordered. And we have to be there at 2.30, and we're like, oh, it's okay for a little late, because it technically starts at 3. So, actually making perfect time, which is amazing.
Fresh. I honestly don't have time to redo the whole face, but sometimes my makeup turns out better when I layer the day's makeup on top of the night makeup that I'm going to do on top of the day's makeup, if that makes sense. I don't know why it turns out better, but I just swear it does. We're going to Flower in Hoboken. It's like a super trendy place. It's BYOB. Not a big fan of it being BYOB, but the food is that good. And it's like fun because you bring your own bottle. So I actually don't mind now that I've been there a few times. But would I like a nice little cocktail made for me? Yes. But I could always have a wine night. And since we were drinking wine all day anyways, it's definitely fine. It was part of the plan. And I already have an outfit idea in my head. I just hope it comes together and actually looks good. George's outfit today was so much better than mine. So my outfit for dinner needs to be better than his. Even though I make out all of his outfits, but he even said he was like, yeah, like, my outfit is kind of better than yours today. Because I just wore a t-shirt, I opted for the comfy option, and I regret it. Never gonna do that again. Okay, here are the outfits. I like how these colors are looking together. <laughs> okay, we are running late. Let's go. The wits were kind of toast. This salad, the best salad I've ever had in my entire life. George doesn't like salad, but I'm obviously forcing him to try it. And you're gonna, you're gonna like, it, I swear, I swear. All right, look at it. It's all cheesy and crunchy. It's so good. It's so good. Just try it. After a while. It's good, I just don't like Caesar. You said you look, it's good, I just don't like Caesar. Look at these pastas. We have the corn, which is my favorite. And then we have the rigatoni. George is like a spicy rigatoni connoisseur. Oh, so Okay, we're doing the corn pasta first. It's Mexican street corn pasta. That sounds so weird, but it's literally, it's out of this world. No, it's insane. How good is that? We were just talking about our favorite restaurants, and I think this is one of my favorite restaurants because the vibe and the atmosphere is just so perfect. Like, it's moody, it's dark. And the food is just like insane. It's the best food ever. You don't have to sacrifice the vibe for terrible food. Now the spicy rigatoni. These are my favorite type of noodles. I don't know what they're called, but I like them because all the sauce gets in there. Spicy? A little bit. Pretty good. George said he's had better, but it's very good. Like I said, he's the spicy rigatoni connoisseur. But I like this one because it has the, you taste the breadcrumbs on it. We are both stuffed to the brim. Like the carrot cake is so good. Last time I got out, I was like, George, I promise you. All right. I'm having the smallest bite. Hey, you're so skinny. Small bite. I just can't eat. Cheers, love. That's good. That's really good. We just got home. So fun.
beautiful. So tired. Yeah. But the best day ever. Yeah. All right. Happy Monday for watching this. Wherever you're watching this, new videos every Monday. Mwah.